Hi, this is Brad with Pro Light Gear, and today I would like to talk about how to boost your uh, your comfort rating on your sleeping bag, how to get more warmth out of the existing kit you have. It's getting to fall here in Bozeman, Montana, and we get calls every single day with people saying, my summer bag just isn't warm enough uh, for these temperatures we're getting right now. Well, there, you don't need a new sleeping bag. Uh, the people are using a 30 degree bag and coming in going, well, I think I need to buy a 15 degree bag just to get through these next, you know, this month before the snow really starts flying hard. And what we're going to do today is show you how you cannot buy another sleeping bag, basically, with stuff that you should be bringing this time of year anyway. We're going to start here with the uh, Mountain Equipment Helium 250. Um, I've got a cheat sheet here with notes on it, so I refer to that. I apologize. The, uh, the bag itself weighs 21 ounces total. And so that is, you know, one pound five ounces compared to a 15 degree or 10 degree bag which weighs anywhere between two pounds five ounces and two pounds ten ounces. What you can do, bring a beanie <coughs> or a balaclava. Uh, when you're experiencing temps down as low as 20, 15 degrees, you should be bringing these anyway. I love having a hat just, you know, normally wearing around camp. You should always have one of these with you. Balaclava is especially nice to sleep in because it seals off the heat around your neck. Uh, those are pretty big veins right near the surface. They tend to bleed a lot of heat. Uh, this will cover the neck and kind of keep that heat in. So I tend to bring one of these. And then you can wear it high and look kind of weird in the back country. It's okay, but they work well as a hat, as a tattoo. Gloves. Gloves inside the sleeping bag are kind of nice. Uh, your hands really radiate a lot of heat. As long as that wrist and your hand are covered, uh, your your core your te core temperature stays warmer, so I'd always recommend bringing a two ounce pair of gloves. Balaclava was two ounces, and the hat was one and a half ounces. And I'll repeat all these weights as we keep going. Down pants. This is one of my favorite items. These are the Montbell down pants, weighing 7.8 ounces. They're incredibly warm. I take these with me, whether it's winter camping or summer camping. I use a 50 degree sleeping bag and some nights it's a, it's enough. Other nights I use my down pants to help supplement that 50 degree sleeping bag. So they really end up push, pushing that rating for me a long ways. And with my 50 degree bag and these I can get you know a 30 degree night, 25 degree night, no problem out of them. The other item would be a lightweight down jacket or a lightweight synthetic jacket to go along with it. Just for weight's sake, we're going to do the down jacket today. This weighs in at 9.5 ounces total weight for the Mutt Bell. Drop my cheat sheet. Uh, down parka. <clears throat> the combination of all this gear that you see on the table weighs less than a 15 degree sleeping bag. When you're in the winter camping, you have to get up to make breakfast. You need a jacket to put on. You need long underwear. You need something to put on to keep you warm while you're doing things outside the tent, outside of your sleeping bag. Even at night sitting around the fire, you don't want to just be in your hiking pants and, and light jacket for movement. You need something insulating to where you're not moving. So the way to lighten up your pack is to get dual purposes out of this stuff. The Mont Bell 15 degree, the number one sleeping bag, weighs two pounds, five ounces. So this system, is five ounces heavier than their one sleeping bag. But what you get with this system is a jacket, a pair of pants, a pair of gloves, a beanie, and a balaclava. This is something that if you're going to bring that 15 degree sleeping bag, you're going to need these items anyway so your pack just gets heavier. And if you compare this to the Mountain Equipment 10 degree sleeping bag at 2 pounds 12 ounces, this will give you the equivalent warmth of that one item all for 2 pounds 10 ounces. So you're saving 2 ounces by carrying extra garments. It doesn't make a lot of sense, but to lighten up your pack weight, this is absolutely the way to go. If you have any questions, please feel free to call in. One of our favorite things to do at Prolight Gear is talk about a system that will work for you. This is just a basic overview of how a lot of the ultralight guys and how a lot of mountaineers end up building a sleep system. Please give us a call or an email and we'll be happy to go over a system that works well for you. At uh, Call us at 406-582-0508 or send us an email at info at prolightgear.com. Thanks for watching.